going to learn yourself. Today we are going to solve, try this numerical from the page number 45. And this sums are under CBSE standard 7 syllabus. From the chapter fractions and decimal. So first question is 7 divided by 2 by 5. So if you have doubt solving the division of fraction by whole number or by a whole number with a fraction, then please go through my lesson number 3 and get an idea about how to do a division with all the three different categories. So I have given the link in the description below. So first go through that lesson and then come back to this video. So first is 7 divided by 2 by 5. So here as per the two steps, how we will solve? This is a whole number divided by fraction. So first we will write 7. Then this division sign we will change it to multiplication sign and the second number we will take a reciprocal of that. So what is a reciprocal? Reciprocal is 5 divided by 2. Here 2 by 5 is the number. 2 by 5 is the number. So reciprocal of this is 5 by 2. When we will convert the numerator into denominator and denominator into numerator, we will write exactly the ultra number of this. Then this is reciprocal of this number. For example, if this is a whole number, then what will be the reciprocal of 3? It, it is going to be 1 by 3. So 1 by 3 is a reciprocal of 3. Now same way if it is 1 by 5 then 1 by 5's reciprocal is 5 because here 5 is in a denominator it will come in numerator when we are taking its reciprocal. Now what is the important thing about reciprocal is when you will multiply the number with its reciprocal then we will get always 1. Why? Because we can cut the numbers above and below. So we will get always 1. Any two reciprocal we will take. 3 multiplying with 1 by 3. So we will get 1. So what is a reciprocal? That when we will multiply the number with its reciprocal, we will always get 1. So that is how we have to take here reciprocal. That numerator will become denominator and denominator will become numerator. Now here, after this, we will follow the symbol multiplication. That 7 into 5 divided by, here nothing is there, so we can write here 1. This is whole number. So, in the denominator of whole number, it is always 1. So, here we are writing 1 divided by 2. Now, at this step, we will see whether we can reduce anything or not. So, no, we cannot reduce anything. So, we will write here 35 divided by 2. Now this is improper fraction that 35 is more than 2. So we will divide here that 35 divided by 2. So we will get here 2, 1 and 15. Again we will get 17 and 14 and we will get here 1. So remainder is going to be 1. So our mixed fraction is 2 is in denom denominator so it will remain here. 17 will come at front. And here we will write 1. So the answer is going to be 17 1 by 2. The second numerical. Second numerical is whole number we are dividing with fraction. So 6 we are writing here. Then division sign we are converting it into multiplication. And this fraction the second numbers reciprocal we will write. So it is 4 by 7. The reciprocal is going to be 7 by 4. So here we will get 6 into 7 divided by 1 into 4. Now at this step we will see whether we can reduce anything or not. So yes we can reduce here that 3 twos are 6 and 2 twos are 4. So here we will get 3 into 7 divided by 1 into 2. So answer is going to be 21 divided by 2. Now again this is improper fraction. We will convert this into mixed fraction. So this is going to be 21 divided by 2. So 2 ones are 2. Here we will get 0 and we will get here 1. But this 1 is smaller compared to 2. So we cannot divide. So we will write here 0. So our mixed fraction is going to be 10 1 by 2. That is going to be our answer. The third numerical. Here this is 2 
in division with 8 by 9. So here we will write first multiplication sign. Then we will take the reciprocal of this fraction. So we are getting it here 9 divided by 8. So let us write this in multiplication that 9 into 2 and in division here we are taking 1. This is whole number so we are taking 1. So 1 into 8. At this step we will see whether we can reduce anything or not. So yes we can reduce 2 4s are 8. So answer is going to be 9 divided by 4. But again this is improper fraction and we will convert this into mixed fraction. So 9 will come here, 4 will be here. So 4 2s are 8, we will get here 1. So answer here is 4 will remain in denominator, this 2 will come at the front and 1 will be at the top. So 2 1 by 4 is going to be our answer. Another set of sum from the page number 45 is the first is 6 divided by 5 1 by 3. So here 6 is a whole number whereas 5 1 by 3 is a mixed fraction. So mixed fraction we have to convert it into improper fraction. So first step we will do that that 6 divided by this we are converting it into improper fraction. So here 5 into 3 15 plus 1 we are taking is 16. 16 divided by 3. So this we have converted into mixed fraction. Now the next step is division sign we will convert it into multiplication sign and then this fraction's reciprocal we will write. That is 3 divided by 16. Now we can do the multiplication. So here 6 into 3 divided by 1 into 16. Here this is a whole number so we can write 1 in its denominator. So 6 into 3 divided by 1 into 16. So here 3 2s are 6 and 8 2s are 16. Here at this step if we can reduce anything we should reduce that. So here 3 2s are 6 and 8 2s are 16. So here answer we will get is 9 divided by 8. So this is again improper fraction. We have to convert this into mixed fraction. So, 9 divided by 8, so 8 ones are 8, we will get here 1 as a remainder. So, answer is going to be 1, 1 by 8 is our answer from this numerical. Now, the next one. Next one is 7 divided by 2, 4 by 7. So, again this is a mixed fraction, we have to convert this into improper fraction. So, it is going to be 7 in division 2 4 by 7 so let us convert this so 2 into 7 is going to be 14 14 plus 4 we will get here 18 18 by 7 now let us multiply them first so first we will multiply and then we will take the reciprocal of this number so it is going to be 7 divided by 18 the reciprocal of this number so 7 into 7 divided by 1 into 18. So our answer is going to be 49 divided by 18. We have to convert this improper fraction into mixed fraction. So we will write here 49 divided by 18. So 18 twos are 36 and as an answer we will get here 3 and 1. So 30. This is a smaller than 18 so we cannot divide further 13 will remain as remainder so the answer here we will get is 18 will be in denominator 13 will come at the top and this 2 will come at the front so 2 13 by 18 will be the answer for this numerical third set of sum from the page number 45 is this so we have to solve this and this is under division of a fraction by another fraction so here two fractions we are dividing with each other. So first is 3 by 5 dividing with 1 by 2. So here let us write 3 by 5. Then the first thing is we have to write multiplication sign. And the second step is we have to take second numbers reciprocal. So this is 1 by 2. So we will write the reciprocal. So it is going to be 2. And in denominator the 1 will come. Because this is going to be our whole number. And in whole numbers denominator there will be always 1. So here let us 
write this as in multiplication 3 into 2 divided by 5 into 1. Check whether we can reduce anything over here. No. So we can write here 6 divided by 5. This is improper fraction. So let us convert this into mixed fraction. 5 ones are 5. We will get here 1. So our answer is going to be 5 remaining denominator. Then 1 will come here and 1 will be at the top. So 1, 1 by 5 is going to be our answer. The second numerical is fraction we are dividing with the fraction. So the first step is 1 divided by 2 in multiplication with the reciprocal of this second number. So 5 divided by 3. Now let us do the multiplication. That 1 into 5 divided by 2 into 3. So the answer here is 5 divided by 6. This is a proper fraction. That 5 is the numerator is smaller than the denominator. So we do not need to convert this into mixed fraction. Third numerical is 2, 1 by 2 divided by 3 by 5. So this is a mixed fraction and we will convert this into improper fraction. So 2 into 2 is 4, 4 plus 1 is 5. So 5 divided by 2 in multiplication with reciprocal of the second number. So it is going to be 5 divided by 3. So what we have done? We have converted this into improper fraction. Then division sign we have converted to multiplication sign. And then we have taken the reciprocal of this second number. So now let us write this 5 into 5 divided by 2 into 3. So here we are going to get is 25 divided by 6. We cannot reduce anything here. So answer is 25 divided by 6. Now let us divide this and write as mixed fraction because this is improper fraction. So 6, 2 is smaller than 6 so we have to take the, both the numbers. So 6, 4 is 24. So here we will get 1 as remainder. So answer here is 6 will be in the denominator, 4 will come at the front and 1 will be at the numerator. So that is how we are going to solve this. The last one is 5 1 by 6 divided by 9 by 2. So let us write this mixed fraction as improper fraction. So 6 into 5. So it is 30 plus 1. So it is 31 divided by 6 and in division with 9 by 2. So now we have two fractions. So let us write 31 divided by 6 and division sign we are converting into multiplication sign and then we are taking reciprocal of the second number. So 2 by 9. So it is 31 into 2 divided by 6 into 9. So at this step let us see if we can reduce anything. So 2, 3 is 6. So answer here is 31 divided by 27 is going to be our answer. Now this is again improper fraction. So let us convert this into mixed fraction. 27. 27 ones are 27. So here we will get 2 and 10. So here 11 is there. So we will get here 4 and here 0. So the answer here is 27 will remain in denominator. 1 will come at the front and 4 will be at the top. So 1, 4 by 27 is going to be our answer.